why, why has the show got such a cult following? What, what makes it so enduring? Of course, why has your show got such a cult following Impl implies it's not watched by very many people. And you might be right. Uh, it's on BBC Two. It does quite well. That's Channel 102 on the Sky EPG. Um, why does it do well? Um, I don't know. I think there's a certain element. I think it resonates with people who work in any large organisation. Um, and, and that what happens in large organisations and indeed in uh, you know, meetings in large organisations is the same whether you're making widgets or television. Uh, it's partly about people grabbing power from one another, it's partly people undermining each other, uh, and it's partly just people trying to get to the end of the day. You've got series series two's been been commissioned. Can you give us a been made? Can you give us a Can you give us a snapshot of what, what we might expect in series two? Right, you might expect uh, what might you expect? Uh, you might expect the notion that uh, the BBC is going to appoint a head of better. Because I think that's important. Uh, and and you might uh, find various other surprises if you view uh, W1A, which starts on, I think I'm allowed to say, probably not, but I'll say it anyway, uh, April the 23rd, which is also, as you know, uh, St. George's Day and Shakespeare's birthday. And the first episode, hour-long episode of uh, W1A, indeed the first hour-long episode we've ever done. Nine o'clock, BBC Two, be there or be somewhere else. Just finally, John, uh, is there anything else that you're, that you're working on at the moment? W1A, uh, no, we've talked about that. Uh, Inside Number Nine, which is a show written by and starring Rhys Shearsmith and Steve Pemberton, who were half of the League of Gentlemen, so I suppose the Le of Je. Uh, and uh, they, uh, we've done six uh, new, as it were, uh, I'm, I'm, again, worried about saying this, but we're, they're sort of tales of the unexpected with, with maybe an added twist. They're sort of sh short stories that occasionally have a dark side. And we've got a fantastic cast yet again. Uh, the first episode has uh, Reese and Steve and Mark Benton and Jack Whitehall and, uh, oh God, and some other people uh, and, and as the series goes on, Jane Horrocks, uh, Alison Stedman, um, uh, uh, sorry, this is just me not thinking myself through, uh, and, and some other fantastic actors and, and stars. Wonderful. Oh, Sheridan Smith, who is brilliant in episode two. Wonderful. Thanks, John, and Julie Ceremony. Thank you very much for your time. Hi.